Hi, I'm Rob the Boating Guy. You know, being out on the water is undoubtedly a great way to spend your time. Frankly, life's just better with a boat. To make sure it always stays that way, you should keep a few simple things in mind to ensure everyone has a great time. For starters, take a little time to plan your day and check the weather forecast. Once you decide where you want to go, you want to think about how you're going to navigate there and then create what's commonly called a float plan. It's basically the route you're planning to take to get to your destination. Then, be sure to take a couple of minutes to share your float plan with someone before you leave. It just makes sense. Actually, a lot of boating safety is really just common sense. Be alert, wear your life jacket, steer clear of bigger, less nimble watercraft, respect buoys and other navigational aids, and operate your boat at a safe speed. By just taking a couple of minutes to run through a checklist before you set off, like making sure the drain plug is in and the bilge pump works, you'll be well prepared for a great day ahead. Every person on your boat should have a life jacket or PFD, that's personal flotation device, that fits them properly. For children, you want good head support, leg straps for smaller kids, and a snug fit so that you can lift them out of the water by their shoulders without the life jacket slipping over their chin and ears. There's lots of different styles and sizes out there. Make sure that yours are approved by Transport Canada, Fisheries and Oceans Canada, or the Canadian Coast Guard before you buy. Everyone wants to have a great time out on the water. You always want to practice safe boating, and the simplest way to do that is by restricting the use of alcohol by everyone on board. Provincial regulations vary, but typically you can only consume alcohol on a boat that has permanent sleeping, cooking, and toilet facilities when it's docked. Essentially, drinking and driving, whether on land or water, is illegal and punishable under the criminal code. As the operator, you're responsible to operate your boat safely, and to do that, your best bet is to keep it simple. Drink non-alcoholic beverages when you're out on the water. That pretty much sums it up. The other basic you need is a boat license. And depending on your age and the type of boat you're driving, Transport Canada regulations require some power boat operators to have a Pleasure Craft Operators Card, or PCOC. By 2009, everyone will need a PCOC to drive a power boat. Your PCOC is similar to a driver's license, and once you receive your PCOC, it's yours for life. You can get yours by studying a basic boating course and then taking a straightforward test. You can get to a list of course providers by visiting discoverboating.ca. Those are just a few key tips for you to be sure that you and the ones you love are having a great time and being safe out on the water.